Hey guys, it's Lee. Uh, just want to let you know what I'm doing. Uh, I've been down here squatting all night. Um, this is the area I'm gonna pan around. This is where I've been at all night. This is the same area that I was in the other day uh, where that guy, him and his son, he had that encounter back in the early 90s um, where they actually had that road crossing right up there that happened. Um, like I said, this is where I've been at all night. I've been up all night, so I'm a, I'm a little tired right now. But I sat up there with the flare and the parabolic dish and I had the dish aimed out this way, right, right dead through there, which would have been going, you know, right through here, going down the creek bed. And all night long, I mean, literally all night long, I've heard movement, just, just branches snapping left and right. Um, last night, about 2.40, 2.45 in the morning, uh, I caught what sounded like a, a high pitch yell or a scream. And the thing about this is, you know, guys, there's nobody back in here, okay? This is this is all forest, creek bed, you can see. There's there's nobody in here but me, okay? So again, about 2.40, 2.45 in the morning, a yell, a scream came from that direction. Then what I thought was what I thought was really interesting, like I said, I've been up all night, I'm tired, sorry. <laughs> what I thought was really interesting is at exactly 4.56 this morning, I heard one single wood knock just a, on a tree. And it came from that direction right there because that's where the dish is aimed at. One single wood knock all night long. Now, maybe it's just me, but maybe that's just a, a one hit on a tree letting them know like, hey guys, it's time to come home, you know, because the reason I say that was Right after, and I mean literally right after, I heard that one hit on that tree. I heard movement down through here, and it sounded like it started moving going up off in this direction, which was weird because probably within two hours before that wood knock, all the sound down here that I was hearing most of the night, like the branches and everything breaking, it, it had all stopped. But right after I heard that one single wood knock, at exactly 4.56 this morning, movement started again. And like I said, it started right here and you could hear something just like, so like it was walking and I could hear it literally going all the way up through here, okay? That's crazy, like I said, <laughs> one hit and it's like in this alarm clock, like, come on guys, come on home. <laughs> yeah, mama's cooking breakfast, gotta go. <laughs> but anyway, this is where we was at. Like I said, this is a dry creek bed, and right up there is where the encounter happened back in the early 90s. Um, been down here all night long, so uh, told you guys I'm out squatting again. And so, but hey, sometimes you get lucky, sometimes you don't. But it wasn't a bad night. It wasn't a bad night. You know, like I said, off and on, heard movement, heard that yell, then the then the wood knock, and heard something take off walking. So. Uh, but other than that, it wasn't too bad. Talk to you later, guys. Thanks.